What's going on guys, welcome back to XCOM 2. Last time we went on the Black Side Coordinates mission and we, uh, well, we actually fought the Warlock there. We executed him with our uh, Psy operative, Hannah. Uh, I didn't even mean to do that, I just wanted to get out of there, but he insisted on dying, so that was kind of cool. And uh, yeah, now we uh, we started building the Defense Matrix, which is pretty amazing. Uh, but let's see what we can do now. I actually kind of forgot what we were doing. Uh, oh, okay. The discovery of this subject encased in a suit similar to your own is intriguing, Commander. The nice. loss of their facility and this specimen could be an even greater victory than we had imagined. Commander, remote reconnaissance indicates the aliens have a UFO hunting for our position. We need to be careful about where we pick our flight paths. Okay, well, Setting we're gonna course for the Indonesian zone. Uh, to get a little bit more supply income. I think that would be pretty useful. Because uh, I think the next supply drop is 5... What do you presume days. to do with that which you have stolen? Your simple minds are surely incapable of understanding that which you have taken from the forge. Right, we're going to continue our side of training. Marx has recovered from his wounds, which is amazing. And we're going to make contact here. Defense facility now operational. Let's check that out. I like how it still shows the advent sign on these turrets. Uh, but either way, that's that's pretty nice. I think we just had someone building this. So, yeah, we might as well staff an engineer here. Yep, perfect. Um, strengthening our turrets, increasing their aim and damage. That's exactly what we want. We can also upgrade it. But we don't have... Actually... Oh, we don't have the power for this. I see. Okay. Now, we could staff another engineer here to increase the power. But some Something I've also been thinking about is that maybe we want to get rid of the Scilab. Because once... I mean, once Bjorn is has finished his training. Because then we have two Psy operatives. I doubt we're going to need more than that. I mean, we already, you know, struggled to, to get the them onto the mission. The taken a great deal from our world. And now they would weave it into something new? Something born of an even more vicious and intolerable process? Yes, guys. Uh, thanks for interrupting me here. But yeah, so I'm definitely thinking about doing that. But we'll finish the uh, education of your first or the training. And then uh, then we'll probably, yeah, we'll, I don't know, change it to something else. I don't know. Oh, is the Avatar progress again? Oh, that might be a... Commander, oh, if no. we want to set back the aliens' work on the Avatar project, we should hit one of their facilities as soon as possible. Well, we don't. We're not really in a rush. I think we currently have a sabotage thing going on, so. Yeah. Just like the one we found the commander in. On the surface, yes. But in function. Ah, commander. Excellent. We can begin. It is no secret that Advent soldiers possess both human and alien genetic characteristics. Preliminary analysis led me to believe that this was the result of direct modifications made to a pre existing human host. Prisoners, or perhaps even unwitting volunteers. See your local Advent recruiter today. However, the reality is something else entirely. The Advent troopers at the facility we discovered, including the specimen before you, were manufactured. Each soldier possesses a unique genetic code. Predominantly human, of course, but with some fragments left open. Left open for what? Whatever alien DNA Advent wishes to insert. Sectoid. Mutine. Even the species our soldiers refer to as Berserker. In all cases, human genetic material serves as a bonding agent, holding the strands together. Human material? You mean the stuff we found at the Black Side facility? Precisely. The key component in their soldier manufacturing process. So we've been fighting ourselves this entire time. In a way. But I believe there's more to it than that. The human DNA in this specimen bears one key difference from the entirety of the sequences decoded in the shadow chamber. Psionic sensitivity. Given the sheer volume of strands involved, this cannot be accidental. Screening process at the clinics. Avatar. The potential power of a being created with this template is significant. Central. 
Had we not intercepted it before the process was completed... I know, Doctor. Continue your research. Let us know if you find anything else. Alright, so we learned quite a few things about, uh, well, about the advent right now, which, to be honest, doesn't seem all that surprising to me. I mean, we already knew it was human DNA, so... And we all already knew that, like, these, these therapies, you know, or the therapy clinics were not exactly what they, you know, seemed to be. Um, and people were disappearing, so, yeah, I mean, I kind of already expected that we were kind of fighting ourselves, so... Anyway, uh, that's, I guess, proves it now, so that's, that's interesting. Let's see if we have, if we have any new projects. No, only the Avatar Autopsy, which we can't go for because we need to finish the other missions first. So, um, yeah. I do wonder if we can remove negative traits. We cannot. Do we have anyone? S yeah, we still have someone wounded. Let's quickly check that out here. We've got a few tired people, and Kim is still wounded, but only for one day. That's fine. You're still training. And you guys are on a covert action, uh, which is going to reduce the avatar progress. So that's actually pretty amazing. And we gain AP rounds. Hand machine from ultra strong, ultra light alien alloys. These deadly rounds will effectively bypass all enemy armor to deal unmitigated damage. Okay, that's really cool. Armor piercing. Armor piercing AP. Pretty sure that's that. Okay. Is that the... That's a covert action, right? Yeah. Oh, it's only one. It's really strange. Sometimes it's one, sometimes two. Not entirely sure why. Our cooperation has proven to be a boon to the resistance. Perfect. Let's assign a new COVID action. Uh, manufacturing upgrade. Uh, will... Intel... Uh, there is a promotion. I really like that. I really like free promotions at this point. It could be really useful. Um, definitely want to go for this one as well. It's just not really a big deal. Okay, let's see. Gain ability points, gain a free promotion. Who could need a promotion? Uh, you're all colonels already, so that's kind of useless. Uh, we can go and give the promotion to... Um, hmm. It's hard to say. It's hard to say, really. Uh, maybe Sam could use them? Maybe Sam could use it? Or Michael. Hmm. Uh, yeah, who could use this? I mean, I don't really want to put a corporal in there because they're rising in ranks quickly anyways. Once we get put them out on missions, obviously. So I think I'll give the free promotion to... You know what? Okay, fine. You know what? We'll... We'll give the free promotion to Michael because he does not have his nickname yet. So we'll give him the free promotion. Once he's a sergeant, he can get his, uh, yeah, he can get his nickname. And then we'll give, uh, yeah, we'll just bring Oscar on this mission as well. Um, there is a high risk of them being wounded. We, we could spend some intel on that. It's only 25, but you know what? Wounds are not really a big problem because, you know, we can always put them in the infirmary, so I'm actually gonna take that risk. Begin the action, please. We will work hand in hand with our new allies. And uh, on the proving ground, let's choose a new project. Uh, powered weapon. Oh, there's so many interesting things. We just did the ammo. Uh, experimental armor, heavy weapon. I, I guess we're gonna go for powered weapon. That's one Liam core and a 50 supplies. That's good, Commander. I'll let you know fine. as soon as the project is ready for deployment. Let's see if we Just can... Just give the word and I'll get started, Commander. ...build anything. Any items? Don't think we need any of that. Maybe some weapons? Spark... Uh, uh, oh, yes. Gremlin Mark Three Specialist upgrade. Definitely gonna go for this. Uh, 50 supplies, 5 alloys and crystals. Uh, it's most advanced version of the Gremlin drone. Significantly increasing the hacking set of all specialists. The specialist abilities are also substantially improved. Awesome. Okay, then we can get for the spark upgrade, but we've never been using it so much, so I don't know. Now, I don't know which... I think this is the newest armor, so we're definitely not going to go for both of them. I think this is totally fine. But yeah, as I said, we don't really use the spark that much, so it's it's not really a, you know, it's high priority. It's been slow priority. going, but I've made headway interfacing our equipment with the alien technology still embedded throughout the ship. Most of the primary systems are now operating on some combination of our technology and theirs. My uh, hope is to use the best of both worlds to come up with something new, something the aliens won't expect. 
I agree, that's uh, that's a nice plan you got there, Ken. Okay, so let's finish this. We've Commander, seen this. we have a line on the chosen warlock here. Okay, now, uh, there is a continental bonus that we could get. I'm getting um, closer the effect every of all... day. You've left quite the trail of destruction. Mm -hmm. At this rate, I'll be touring the Avenger in no time. Uh, we get 75 extra supplies here, and there is only 69. So we're definitely going to build the radio relay here. We need one radio relay, and then uh, the effect of all weapon modifications is increased. So that's definitely what I want to go for. Yeah. Setting course for the Australian I'm not sure sector. How big that is, but it's probably like it's probably about like I don't know, five percent maybe. I do not think I could have predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. I have come to suspect that this creature's unusual appearance is somehow directly connected to its notable psionic aptitude. The aliens always have some reasoning to their actions, even as twisted as it is often revealed to be. So this version of this psionic amplifier incorporates artifacts from the powerful gatekeeper alien we encountered. It will put our experienced psi operatives on the same level as the aliens' most powerful psionic forces. That's amazing. Um, and then, yeah, we have no research left. That's pretty impressive. So I guess we'll just research. I had assumed these you'd make that research a priority, Commander. To get I'll notify info. you as soon as the record is available. And yeah, we've got no more wounds. Commander, that UFO contact has us locked in. We have to take evasive maneuvers. We have detected an alien UFO in close proximity to the Avenger, and it is rapidly advancing towards our position. So this is one of the dark events I've not seen before. Distance. Uh, less than 500 miles, speed 628 miles per hour, so it's, yeah, less than an hour. Okay, begin evasive maneuvers. Setting course oh, there it is. for Indonesia. That's cool. Okay, it seems to be able, we seem to be able to get away. Okay, never mind. Gotta kill it. Emergency power online. Someone get me a damage report. We've got a problem. Only one. They've just dropped some sort of spike outside. It's generating the same type of pulse that knocked us out of the sky. They don't want us. They want the ship. Isn't there some way you can override it? Not from here. I can't get our engines online while it's out there. Commander, we're gonna have to do this the old-fashioned way. Destroying that spike is our only chance of getting out of here. We can't let the aliens take this ship. We're going down, Commander. UFO contact has disabled our systems. Brace yourselves. All right, so Operation Foolish Vanguard. Uh, defend the Avenger. The Avengers are on attack. It must be defended at all costs. Ready your troops, Commander. Okay, so another Avenger defense. Commander, we can deploy some of our wounded troops back into combat if you feel it's necessary. This operation is critical to our efforts. We may not have much of a choice if we want to proceed. I see. Okay, that's interesting to know so however this is a bit different than the uh than the chosen adventure assault because we don't get to pick 10 people and get to pick six uh but it's also only difficult not very difficult now we're gonna bring our best people here jonathan as our lead grenadier in his war suit then aaron is tired i i would like to avoid bringing him kim is ready let's bring him let's bring ulfred as our ranger um, might as well bring Witch, uh, that's cool, then I think Odin as our sharpshooter, and, yeah, you know what, I'm gonna bring Manon, 
Rapier. I think this is probably the best way to handle things. We've got two Grenadiers, a Sharpshooter, a Specialist. What do we not have? What do we not... We have Ranger, Sharpshooter, Specialist, Grenadier. Okay, and then I think this is fine. Let's just uh, make the utility items available. And uh, Manong, I will... I will actually give you an exosuit. There you go. You add on also... Okay, hold on. You get the... Uh, you don't... I don't want you to... I want you to have the shredder gun. There you go. So then you have the rocket launcher, blaster launcher, shredder gun. That seems amazing. You've got the med kid. You've got acid grenade. You know what? I'll give you the... I'll give you... Hmm. Hold on. Let's see. We've got new rounds. I, I, I guess I'm going to give you the... Armor piercing ignores five points of armor. I will give you the blue screen. So you're better against Mac. Then I will give you the Talon rounds, I think. Causing great internal damage. Yeah, more crit chance. I think that's good. You have the axes as well. You've got the Mimic Beacon. You... I'm probably going to give you... Uh, the Mimic Beacon, if we can do that, because you're not really going to be shooting that much. Maybe you get the Armor Piercing Rounds. You've got the Med Kid, and then you get the, uh... You get the Mimic Beacon if we need it. Um... Grenade on you... Can give you a Flashbang. Sure, why not? Have a flashbang grenade. We've got plenty of heals, I think. This is probably good. Unless we want to have... A mine shield could be useful. Let's just go with another medkit. I think this is this is cool. This is a pretty cool setup. Alright, let's go for it. Because we do have, you know, a lot of uh, heavy weapons as well. I'm feeling pretty good about this. Although your will isn't perfect. Um, we'll have to go for it. Okay, so instead of a gun trying to destroy the ship, we have something that disrupts it. I guess it doesn't matter. Either way, we're going to have to destroy it. Um. <sighs> but at least it said difficult, so I don't think any Chosen will show up. So this should actually be relatively easy even for our crew. One five situation critical. Primary Avenger systems are offline and hostiles are moving to engage. Shen, any updates? Commander, we've got a critical system failure. The Avenger is dead in the water. I'm diverting reserve power to the scanners, and they're picking up a powerful radiation source nearby. We need to locate and destroy whatever it is disrupting our system. We may have a bigger problem, Commander. We're picking up heavy comm traffic. Dozens of Advent transports are inbound on our position, and they've got battleships in tow. The aliens are sending everything they've got. We have to get this ship off the ground, or we may not make it out of this one. Alright, so we've got this thing that we need to destroy, which is conveniently placed next to a house. And then we saw a few enemies. We've got our, I guess this is the Avenger uh, ramp. We've got uh, two turrets here, which is cool. So this is our defense matrix. Uh, destroy the disruptor. Enemies must not reach the Avengers ramp. Okay, so we have to hold that off. We do have some high grounds to this side, but that's pretty far away. Um, okay, let's see who we're gonna start with. Probably our Ranger Ulfrid. Um, hmm. Or... Or, let's see, how about Jonathan, or Manon? I mean, you know what? Fine. Let's have Manon in here. Even. It's really loud, gotta say. Okay, don't see anything. Moving! Perhaps we want to move up? It's hard to say. You're not concealed, we don't have anyone concealed. 
shop here. Finally. Kim. Oh, we've got full cover. Orders confirmed. Moving out. Ursula. Now, we can use the Icarus jump to get up. In fact, that might be something I would do. Just to kind of get an, get an idea as to where we are. Could I, could I go right here? It does not seem to be possible. I do wonder if we have vision from here. Let's see. Let's see what we see. Okay, we haven't found anyone. We don't have vision on that thing, unfortunately. Uh, but I guess we'll go on... I guess we'll go on Overwatch here. Moving to Overwatch. Jonathan, at least... Okay, at least we do know that we can move up. So maybe that's what I will do. Move him up. Let's move already. I've been troops here. Oh, darn. Just spotted him. Maybe an Overwatch triggers. And actually hits him. I'll take it. Although it's really loud again. I swear. Oh, and he's panicked. That's amazing. But I, I, I do swear to you that uh, the, the audio keeps changing. I don't know. I don't know what that is. Okay. Now, we can actually shoot with our turrets as well. Let's go ahead and do that. We missed. Oh, we get the second shot. Let's go for it. Oh, we missed both times? Come on! Hmm, fine. Can you hit? No, but we do have plasma grenades. That would actually hit both of them. Why can I not click it? That will shred some armor of the Mac. Feel a bit of damage as well. Can't do anything with Ulfred. He's panicked. You have a shot. Okay. Oh, at the back. Oh. Nice. Good hit. We might even kill it. If this if this hits, we miss the other one. Okay, nice. The Mac is destroyed. And then now. You know what? I'm this guy's a shield bearer, so he's we know he's not gonna attack. He's panicked. He could do anything. I'm probably gonna a protocol you. The best thing to do. You can have a shot. 50% shot. No, I'll take it. Get the threat assessment there as well. Oh, we can hit him. Sweet. Enemy eliminated. And then we still got you. With nothing to do. Let's take the full cover. The power guides me. So the shield bearer, we know what he's gonna do. We might even get the overwatch. Yep. Okay, sad, sad we missed, but that's okay. Not even close. Commander, I'm sending reinforcements in from the Avengers reserves. Ooh. And there it is, Dana. That's cool. Uh, we can actually even grapple up here. And we see Rampino. someone. That's perfect. A little bit of high ground. Except we don't see anyone. Okay. Except we would. Um, hmm. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's bring... Manong up to probably here. Je vais en position. Oh, there's more enemies. Ooh, five of them. <laughs> now, luckily with this, we don't have like we don't have a uh, a timer in the sense that like there's no avenger durability. We don't have to hurry. Okay, this is kind of interesting though, isn't it? Maybe the turret can shoot? 45, that's not really great. 
Okay, they actually have quite a few men. That's interesting. We need to get here. We not somehow need to get there. We've got 80% shot on the commander. Does Dana see anything? She does. She does see the elite or the elite officer. Ah, oh, my mistake. Hmm. Now, Ulfred, I would like to put into full cover. We could run and gun. There's more enemies there as well, and I don't need to trigger them necessarily. 77. Maybe we can kill the shield bearer. I wouldn't mind. But. Hmm. I don't want to trigger the other group. We saw that there was an Archon there. Okay, what are our options here? We can throw another. Actually, we can go for the shredding. We don't really have vision on those guys. It's a little bit unfortunate. Are we still gonna go? Moving here? the designated coordinates. 37, that's not cool. We do have combat protocol. Hmm. Saturation fire. That might be cool. That's like the shredder gun. But we're gonna actually blow our own cover if we do this. Okay, I'm not totally convinced yet. Order's confirmed. On the move. We do see this guy. Alright, you know what? I think Dana from back here will take a shot. Nice. Nine damage. And I think what we'll do now is I'll take the tower to kill the commander if possible. We've got two shots. Nice. And we could even go on Overwatch with him, so I think we'll do that. Then, hey, okay. I guess you'll try and take out the uh, shield bearer. I've got something over here. Nice. How many is that now? Is that We all of a sudden triggered this group for some reason. We did it before. Oh, there's the tower. Good damage. So the question is though, like, it says do not reach the Avengers ramp. So we definitely need to kill those. Like this is this is a big deal. I do have AP rounds. We might be able to kill them. No armor. Yes. Nice. Enemy yeah, eliminated. Still the purifier. With several purifiers. Now we could throw a grenade that would hit two people. And we do have Ulfred and Ursula still. They haven't moved yet. Actually, he could move here. But then th that thing might blow up. Okay, I think this is the highest priority right now. Let's see if we can... 50% chance. That's not guaranteed kill. By the Shredder gun. So you're gonna hit him. Uh, oh, we've got this turret as well. He can't see anything, fortunately. We can't get there. Can we get anywhere? Yeah, we can only hit him. I think we will. Start off with this. I strike for my people! And then we've got Curse their armor! Oh okay, we almost actually triggered those guys. It's actually quite a few people now. So I think we'll move back. Now we are kind of in trouble, aren't we? I could throw the axe. And kill the viper. I think 
think I will. That's a good kill and was didn't cost us an action. Can this turret shoot? No, not in range, unfortunately. Okay, we do have the Rage Strike, which is also a free move. I could Rage Strike, shoot. Go for it. Seven damage. And now from up close, I think we can kill a ten. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, uh, twelve. We need twelve, but there's also 45 percent crit chance. I think we'll just go for it. Do a blade storm. Okay, ten damage. It's not exactly enough. But we do have blade storm, don't we? So yeah, if he's gonna move, he's, he's dead basically. Uh. Okay, then we still have this guy. Damn. Now, if I... If I was to send... Blast Bomb. Let's Rupture again. Launch the Acid Grenade. That might actually be enough. Hey, you know what? Let's move back. Just so that we're not in the range of that thing. don't have anything. Let's go to Overwatch. He might hit this guy if he moves. We could go for Plasma. Removing the cover and the armor. Go for it. But we can actually maybe kill him now. Let's go for it. So he was the closest one. I think that was kind of important that we did it this way. Hostile neutralized. So he's gonna come up. I cannot stop the flames! Okay, that sucks. Blades don't kill it. Nice. You can't handle me! This trooper could be a problem. Doc! I was protecting! We I can't slow the fire now! The burning is a problem. Uh... Can you do anything? No. Alright. Let's see. I definitely want to kind of take this. Here I come. And we actually see the objective that this looks like the stuff. Okay, this Venice one five. We have visual confirmation on the disruptor. Destroy it and let's get the hell out of here before it's too late. Do we have spot side? No, fortunately not. Well, what I could do. Yeah, that could be potentially problematic. Hmm. Now if we go in here, this one, the last one didn't blow up, so this one's pretty certain to blow up. Kind of unfortunate. I do want to heal Ursula. Maybe I should heal afterwards. This explosion is gonna take some damage. Yeah, she's gonna take some damage, but let's a focus strike of power! And we'll heal afterwards. Yeah, time is getting shorter. Damage and armor shredded. But should be fine. We are going for the heal. Go help him out. It's not going to be fully restoring. 
but actually, maybe, yeah. No longer burning, that's amazing. And she should go on parry. So she is immune to the next attack. Odin could send in. Probably rather go for Monongo. Uh, probably. Do it. Yeah, this turret isn't really too helpful for right now. 62. I'll just take the shot. Nope. Okay. So the turret is not really helpful. Dana can't really do much either, I would say. I guess we'll just bring her up. And um, Kim. I don't really see his benefits. Moving to designated position. Yeah, I don't really see what I can do right now. get up here but it doesn't I just he's like I don't see him that's the problem okay maybe Jonathan can do something he does see him that's affirmative 80% come on kill him. through the fire nice okay that's no longer an issue Enemy's down. Okay, I think with that we can... Well, do we... How do I see this thing? Probably not at all. I'm tired of waiting around. Okay, we see it now, but we don't have a move anymore. Let's go and pistol over one. We should shoot from here, so that's good to know. You have squat side on it. Commander, I'm sending reinforcements in from the Avengers reserves. Commander, the situation just got worse. Resistance outposts are reporting enemy transports on the move across right, this region. Aaron. They're getting ready for an all-out assault. I see. That's not good. We need to destroy this ASAP. We do. Do we have the grapple available? Not yet. We would have sight on this. Okay, problem, so we'll, we'll take it out with our snipers. I think that's probably the best course of action. Of the squat side 9 to 11. Yeah, we actually only need one more shot. Oh, so close. Actually, hold on. Hold on. Can we? Oh, we can shoot it. I think we should. I think we should. So, Dana will have you. Oh, it's really so cool, but I think. Um, Let's put Ursula in here and have have you on pistol overwatch. I'll keep a watchful eye. Jonathan, overwatch. Well, uh, Manon, move up. I'm Zelda. Yeah, these towers are currently not that useful. They were useful in the beginning. Have you an overwatch? Aaron, uh, bring you up. Don't really know what to do with you. I think we'll just go for it. Destroy that thing. Okay, cool. Not sure if we trigger those guys now. Target destroyed. Excellent work, Menace 1 -5. Awesome. Shen, what's our status? Whatever it was, destroying it seems to have lifted the disruption field. Engine control systems are coming back online. We should be clear to take off within 60 seconds. Awesome. So, return... Commander, we can take off on your order. We should get the squad on board and get moving. Okay, we'll return all Axum soldiers to the Avengers ramp. Um, issue takeoff command. Enemies must not reach the Avengers ramp. Okay. Well, there is some reinforcements coming, so we'll have to probably... Fight them. Might as well overwatch you. And then Aaron... 
we could... You know what I might do? You know what I might do? Running gun. Sturman on Sheason! Get you in here. Positive. Go for the overwatch. Fire shots! And then Kim. We will aid protocol. Uh You know what? I will aid protocol you because you don't have an overwatch. So now you have one. And we can shoot from back there. I think whoever comes will be smoked. I do wonder if it's going to be the standard three enemies or if it's going to be more. I guess we'll find out. Now we'll have an overwatch. Overwatch. So lots of overwatches. Moving to overwatch. So there are the reinforcements. Looks like the standard three. Okay. Oh, two only. That's not that bad. Alright. We'll easily finish him off. I've got eyes on an advent position. They should be dead. Need to find some new cover! Pistol? Uh... Yeah, that looks like a miss. Nice, Jonathan. Oh, forgive me. It might even be a kill. Ooh. Priest smoked them. Dead. He is here. Stasis, probably. Yes. God damn him. Hostiles pacified. Fire spreading. Okay. But Menace one five. Be advised, we've picked up oh. hostile reinforcements inbound on your position. I see. So they're gonna bring reinforcements all the freaking time now. Okay. What we have to do is run you just far back, like as far back as possible. Okay, let's run Ulfred back. He's the first Go, away. go, go! Then, let's see. Which needs to run away as well? Probably. Well, let's see. Jonathan can move back. Okay, let's see. We've got plenty of people here. Manon needs to move as well. Manon can move back. She's on a good. Uh, the turret. We need to get our snipers away. Dana has the grapple. She can grapple back here. Salgo. Um, okay. She does have... She could set up a kill zone here. Queen no si passa. Let's do that. Aaron, I might conceal him. Activate the town over. Then we can basically be anywhere. Let's go here. Slow, slow, slow. Kim. Okay, let's see. Manong is already safe. Hmm. Jonathan. Could retreat here. Okay. Understood. Good. Moving out. We've got which? Yeah, you need to move here somehow. I guess if I move just in here, we should be safe. Okay, who else have we got? We've got Odin. Now he can just jump back home, so that's ideal. Yeah, jump here. Perfect. Nice, and then we'll go on Overwatch. I'm on it. Overwatch. Overwatch. Okay. Um. Yeah, I want Kim. Ah, uh, that's not Kim, but uh, I want you. You. Probably just back here. You're not gonna be able to do anything. Good to go. And then you can go here. I can cover it. Okay, that's all the moves. But we've got a lot of overwatches. We should be fine. Moving to overwatch. Oh, and we get a free overwatch. Nice. Well, whoever comes, we should be able to destroy them. Oh, three of them now. Oh, okay. An officer is not last for and a man. They certainly bring a lot. I've been troops spotted. This guy's back. 
hopefully can kill him somehow. Luckily, never triggered the Muton group and the Kodaks. Oh, badness. Oh, look at the turret. Nice. He dodged it, though. Wait, that's it? No kill zone? Oh, that's bad. He's gonna mind control. Resist, 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 please. Otherwise, it's gonna be such a pain in the ass. Alright. Damn. That's I annoying. Am called, called to serve them. But, regardless. Okay, so that's interesting. We do have vision, but our overwatches didn't trigger. It's kind of annoying, if I do say so myself. Let's kill the Lancer. Well, that's maybe not. So we got the overwatch on this one. Uh, let's see what our turrets can do. Let's remove the overwatch first. Nice, okay. Let's try this again. 73, that's our best shot. Nice. So that's one thing down. What can you see? You can only see him. 55, you know what? Let's go for it. Oh wow, he smoked him. Alright, that's cool. So these turrets are certainly helpful. This command, I'm not sure what we're going to do with. But we need to get rid of this guy. I do wonder, he only has one health. Can we... Go for a rocket there. Ready for the fireworks. Nice. All we needed. Good. We got implacable. So we can actually move back. Let's do this. And then which can you can actually move up here. Rolling. You can move in here. You have a hundred percent shot. Oh that's rent. Right. I don't want to move outside anymore. As you direct. So we've got five soldiers remaining. Uh, Jonathan can make it in. Confirmed. Uh, Manon can make it in. She back to you. Uh, Aaron can make it in. Sean on that X. So who have we got left? Dana, can you make it in? Yeah, certainly. Not in cover, but that's okay. Oh, that's the only soldier we need. Okay. That's all the soldiers we have? So the commander's not going to get killed, but I think this is fine. We're just getting out of here. Uh, unless, of course... Have we got any... You know, we have got the blaster bomb. Let's see. I think the commander was here. Better start running. Let's do that. Just because we can. Yep. Cool. That was a nice hit. Um, don't think we've got anything else. The shredder gun is probably too... Yeah, it's too far away. Alright, I guess with that, we'll simply... We've got no soldiers remaining, so we can just lift off the Avenger. Let's go for it. Excellent work, Commander. Looks like the Avenger lives to fight another day. Glorious. Awesome. So we, yeah, four people were left. One soldier's wounded. That's okay. Don't let them fight alone. Oh, look at this bird! That's actually kind of cute. But, let's see what else we've got. Oh, fire! And a dead Advent Mac. Looks like fire's coming out of his head. I like it. Awesome. So that was the UFO hunting us. Cool. <laughs> Certainly easier than fighting a Chosen and having to take out a gun, uh, but still fun.
And of course, we've got much better gear one now. One by one, we're evening up the score, Commander. Good work out there. Yep, but yeah, our people are quite tired. Especially because, here's the thing, right? We got two people, uh, Aaron and Dana, uh, joined in later as well. So that's cool. So we had actually eight people in total. And we got an advanced automotor as well. Okay, Kim is shaken. Oh, Dana as well. Rest required. Yeah, I know. I know. Okay, but the defense matrix was... I, I, I definitely gotta say it was useful. It definitely was useful. Alright. Um, let's check this out. So we've got a this few soldiers. Being taken from the Elder's facility is unknown to my kind. It is something other than ourselves. An attempt at recapturing something lost. It must be destroyed, as is the fate for all bound creations of the Elders. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's the way it is. What we were doing, we were, um... We were building a radio Setting plane. course for Sector Over. 2, Australia. Now that we're no longer being hunted. Okay, you have... Uh, learn a new ability. Let's go for stasis. I think this is good. Being able to take like a sectopod, put him in stasis. Our inspiration did prove beneficial. Yes, Commander. Yeah, so we don't have any more researches. Oh, actually, improved pistols. Dealing more damage? Hell yes. I foresee a number of valuable applications stemming from this technology. Yeah, I'll have a report assembled as soon as the research is complete. Continue your petty games. Eventually, there will be no place left to run. So that's really cool. A sabotage attempt on one of our facilities was unsuccessful. Cool. Next time, perhaps you should pay more attention to these things. So advanced sunglasses doesn't have a chance to move after performing a melee attack. That's unfortunate, but it's not a the end of the world, really. Reading you loud and clear. Okay, so we get more supplies and insight knowledge. The effect of all weapon modifications is increased. I wonder by how much, but uh, yeah, it's useful either way. So you figured out a new trick, eh? Yep. I'm not sure it will do you any good. I wonder if we it's can make contact. It's certainly not going to scare me no. off. Okay. I kind of would like to finish this just because it's already in our contact network. And we do need to make, w make our way over here. Um... This is something we need to go for. Yeah, the codex rank coordinates. So we need to head over to the Americas somehow. Um, we, mid we might also finish up Africa. The laboratory facilities provides an national 20% boost, which we don't really need that much. And there we've got, okay, training. Mm, on every mission, there's a chance an advent unit will join the XCOM squad. Oh, that's cool. Wow, we could have like technically six people on a mission. That's cool. And then munitions expert, experimental ammo pro project improving grounds are completed instantly. Okay, what are we gonna go for? Maybe extra supplies. Avenger Probably. plotting new course. And we definitely need some more contacts. I think this is kind of the most important thing. Just so we can reach that thing. Oh, and there's our guerrilla ops. Okay. So we have a very difficult one. Uh, Advent loot. Ooh, a lot of supplies. Advent troopers will carry more explosives. It says very difficult neutralizing a field commander. Uh, and Andromedon, a sectoid, elite officer, a sectopod. Okay, so this is a pretty, pretty big deal. Then we've got Operation Sleeping Cry. Uh, we get an engineer. Don't really need that. Show of force until there's a large number of Advent troopers. Um, and then we've got this. A ranger. Rapid response, guarantees, reinforcements. We don't need that, so I think this is what we go for. And extra loot, this could potentially amount to a lot of supplies. Like, maybe like 400, which would be amazing. I think this is what we're going to go for. Yeah, we've got Andromedon, a Sectopod, a Heavy Mac. Setting right. course for Western Europe. I feel Europe. like we can deal with that. I feel like we can deal with this. Because, yeah, supplies is kind of necessary. We want to build some things. In fact, isn't there something I can upgrade? Yeah, the Psy Operative. We don't have enough supplies for that. Okay. Then we've got a few vests. The thing is, I can't really use the vests because we already don't really have... 
We don't have enough spots. I will figure out who I'm gonna bring on this mission. Uh, it's likely they're gonna encounter uh, Chosen on this one, which shouldn't be a big deal. Um, but yeah, I will probably do this in the next episode, or I will for sure do this in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed. Yeah, I'll see you next time.